I'm back y'all. I am biggity back. It has been two months. I think about two months. This release was in June, right? June, July, something like that. Well, I am back and I am finally going to shoot this video right here, the Ivy Paradise. Now, I spent $1,900 on this um, drop and um, this drop was very weird because it dropped like early for some countries, like days early. And then for other people, um, it dropped like early, early, early in the morning. And so I'm just like, uh, okay, I'm waking up at 5 a.m., 6 a.m. And I'm on the app and it's just kicking me out. Like the Adidas app just literally just froze and kicked me out. So I'm like, hey, whatever, whatever, it's good, whatever. Then um, we finally get the countdown that at 9, uh, 9 p.m. or 9 a.m. Uh, specific standard time, uh, it is, that's when it's officially going to drop. Um, so got on the website, tried to do it on my phone, and I was like, you know what, let's just not do it on my phone, let's go to my MacBook. Got on my MacBook, and um, yes, I got everything. So I thought, I had two things, or two boxes that shipped out. Um, for, uh, one box, and then another box, and then I had one item just sitting there, and I'm like, why hasn't it shipped out? That was the sequin button up top. Unfortunately, I did not get it because Adidas is disrespectful and they got problems. I love you, Adidas. I love this collection and I love Adidas for that. But the fact that Adidas needs to understand when you when we purchase something, y'all need to look at the times. If I purchased it at 9 o'clock on the motherfucking dot, bitch, give me my shit. Because I'm not playing these games with these people. $1,900, that's a lot of money. We spending money. Adidas, get it together. Now, Beyonce on the other hand, why did we get everything? There are some things I wanted that only Brazil got. That's the real TV. But anyways, you answers. Welcome back to my channel. And let's get on to this Ivy Paradise haul. There's no unboxing because I got no boxes. So, but yeah, let's get on to this haul. So first we're gonna start off with the accessories, of course. Um, so we're gonna start off with the bucket hat. There's some things that do have tags on them and there's other things that do not. I definitely have been wearing this stuff for the past couple months or whatever um so if i'm not saying prices i'll link them to the side or whatever but okay so we have an ib part bucket hat right here and we have boom boom so we have the adidas logo the ib park logo and this bucket hat was 55 dollars. it is reversible so you can turn it around the other side and it's pink and also this drop was correlating with Icy Park and that's why I have my Icy Park on. So I have unreleased um, shorts on right here. Um, and then I have the crop top and then the Icy Park, um, just regular tee that we have with the hat. Um, but definitely, yes, we have this right here and it says Ivy Park all the way across it. I don't know if you have to see it that way, which I'll show up this way too. But yeah, so we have the bucket hat, $55. I love the bucket hats. I got it in a, uh, what is it? A medium large. I wish it had just like a medium size so it doesn't fly off my head, but it's okay. Uh, we gonna do what we need to do, of course. So we got the bucket hat, $54, um, reasonably priced or whatever. They went up from, I think this is what's been the normal price now for these. So there's that, the bucket hat. Next, next accessory item, we have the visor. Now the visor I believe was also 55, I'm not quite for sure, but I definitely put it on the side for y'all. Um, this is big, like wide, like, hold on, let me, let me just go ahead and, like she's wide. She's blocking out all the sun, honey, blocking out all the sun. Um, but we do have the logo right here. And we do have an Adidas logo embroidered right there for you too. And yeah, um, I took off the little tag piece because that's getting in the way and I might even just cut this piece off too. I haven't done that quite yet, but I wore it for a performance, just one. Um, she's cute. This is this is a little bit different. Um, it's like, it's I don't know if it's metal or not or they just wanted to do it, but there's um, a little Adidas flower that's right there also. So that's a little bit of a detail for y'all. Um, also, the Barbie movie premiere. We I definitely went to my Ivy Park, honey. I'll show y'all some pictures, maybe, I don't know yet. Um, but we're gonna move along to the next one. Um, okay, so we're gonna go with all the pants and shorts next. 
Uh, unfortunately, this drop did not get any shoes, and unfortunately, I did not buy any socks. The socks were the heel socks, so it had the little cutout where the heel, uh, where you can, the women or men can wear heels. Um, now they advertise, they were advertising like in the promo pictures of sh uh, regular socks and also slides. We never got them. Also, there's bags and stuff that we never got. Like what? There's a disco ball bag that I kind of wanted. There was like, uh, I don't know if it's a backpack or like a uh, like a lunch pail bag, They're like a big one. Uh, I wanted that. Like, y'all really dropped the ball by not releasing this stuff and then have the nerve to do a floaty only for in store while stock, while they have stock. First of all, not everybody has an Adidas store near them. I have to drive six hours to the nearest Adidas store. Don't do that no more. Don't do that no more, Adidas. Get this go. Anyways, onto the shorts. So I got the sequin uh, friend shorts. These are in a size large. They are super cute. I love these so much. Um, I don't, we're just not gonna, I'm not gonna say the price anymore for anything because I don't know how much these were and I forgot to write my cheat sheet down and I don't wanna get out my MacBook. So yeah, we have these shorts. They're super, 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 super cute. Now I definitely think I could have got a medium instead. They fit around my waist perfectly, but my butt does not fill in all of this extra space that's back here. Um, we do have the regular button, just a little pink button, no emblems. We have a zipper inside if you guys didn't know that. And these are also very uncomfortable. <laughs> so ladies, men, everybody in between, please wear like leggings, not leggings, but um, stockings or um, fishnets or something uh, definitely under these because um, it's it's see-through, very much see-through and the sequences is like, you can see the stitching of it. So, but they're very comfortable. There are no side pockets. There are only the back pockets that are here. So we do have that. And for um, our Adidas emblems and stuff, we have the three stripes on this side in a um, more of a, more of a bright pink color. And then uh, we also do have, let's see, let's, let me find the Adidas logos and stuff. Cause knowing me, okay, so we have the Ivy Park logo right here. If you guys can't see, it's right there, the Ivy Park logo. Just right, right, right there, Ivy Park logo. And I think that is it. I always, sometimes I always miss them. Like if there is a Adidas logo. Usually it's in one of the corners, but I think I got it. And I don't think they put an Adidas logo on this one. But here are the French shorts. Next, we have the swim trucks in pink. And okay, so the col this colorway is called Cozy Pink. She decided to name it Cozy Pink. Um, shorts, I believe they were $75, I think. Um, do I have a tag in these ones? Oh, I do have a tag in these ones. Oh yes, I got them in a size medium. Right there for you, $75. Um, these are very cute. It does have the liner in it, so there are, there's a liner in them, of course. Um, but these are just like the Flex Park ones that we have before. Same exact thing, I believe. Um, only thing that's different in these ones, we have the Adidas logo right here. And then we have, or sorry, the Adi Park logo on that side. And then we have the Adidas logo on this side. The three sides running down, of course, but the only thing that's different is we don't have the Ivy Park that was right here. Um, those ones are only on the uh, Flex Park orange pants. Uh, we have accessible pockets on both sides. Um, did I just lie to y'all? I just lied to y'all. There's no pockets. There's only the cargo pocket on this side right here. The little cute little cargo pocket and the little bag pocket back there. So that's the only thing we got. But there are, these, are, these are the shorts. Very cute, very comfortable. If you guys want to cut off the liner, you're more than welcome to. But we have the white stripes going all the way down on each side. Next item, I'm gonna fly past this thing real fast. Okay, we have the, you know what, I'll go with the shorts first. Okay, we have the sh two-in-one shorts. Uh, they're shorts 
And for a special surprise for some people, they're also a Speedo. So it comes inside. Let's see. Take this out. Okay. Now, here are the shorts. They're like just regular like running shorts or whatever. So we have these right here, of course. Uh, they're like cute little running shorts or whatever. Um, lounge around shorts, very cute. The three stripes, of course, it's Adidas. Um, we have the Ivy Park logo right there. And we have the Adidas logo right there. And on the inside, it's literally just normal. This. Just, 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 yeah, just normal. Um, yeah, these are the shorts. Now, onto the Speedo. The Speedo. This is super cute. I can't wait to wear this. Um, I wore some pictures or whatever, but mm -hmm. these are super, super, super cute. Here are the Speedos. We have the three stripes right here. Um, and we have a big Ivy Park logo on the back right there. And we have the Adidas logo on this side also. So we have that. But these are very cute. They fill out everywhere you need it to be. And if you got a big bulge, honey, it's gonna show in these and they're gonna look real cute. So um, yeah. And then I guess you can tell the monogram and then this monogram. So um, it's a little bit different. It, this monogram is more of a, um, what is the colorway of these? Let me see if I can see the colorway. It's a uh, Mesa Dark Brown Cream. That's what I'm guessing it is. But I don't think I showed you guys the tag, but it's a medium and it was $95 for these. So $95 for some shorts and a Speedo. A little pricey, but we got it anyway. So on to the next item. Oh, excuse me. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we got the sequin. Um, leggings? Is that what these that's what they're called? This, this, the leggings? I don't I don't know exactly what they're called. But we have the thick band right here. Ivy Park on it. On all the way through, all the way on this side and on the inside of it, of course. These are very much see-through, honey. These are see-through. Like, if I wear something wrong with this, you're going to see everything. So, definitely uh, put something under this that's cute, but it's meant for the pool, so you never know. But we do have the Ivy Park logo um, under all the sequins in here. And I believe I got these in a size, what size is this? A size large. I usually get all of my women's uh, stuff in a size large. So these are very cute. They're not that comfortable either, but they're cute to wear and the beauty is pain. So you gotta run and you gotta go through it. But they're very, 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 very long. So for my short girlies out there, my short men, um, you might have to get these hemmed or anything, you know, something like that. Cause these are very long. They're long on me and I'm five, five, nine, five, ten on a good day. So uh, definitely, yeah. And these were, I don't know how much they cost. I put them on the screen. So yeah. They're not really like much to say about this. These are cute though, but these are the ones they wore on tour too, also, by the way. They wore those on tour. Um, now onto the pink stuff, onto the pink tops. Um, we're gonna start off with the bomber jacket. The bomber jacket with the fringe, baby. The fringe, like she went all in on this. Now, this is also see-through. I don't know if you can see the back of it. Yes, I don't know if you guys can see the, um, the hanger in the inside of it, maybe. But like with me looking at it through the lights, I definitely can see it. Now, um, this was $300. If I'm not mistaken, it was $350 actually. It might have been $350. But we do have the three stripes right here. We have the fringe going all the way down on each side. Uh, we do have the little pocket. Of course, it's a bomber jacket. We have the little Ivy Park logo right there. Uh, we also have another Ivy Park logo on the zipper. Now, like I said, I have worn a lot of this stuff, so it does look a little crusty looking like right here, <laughs> it looks a little crusty looking, but I have been wearing it, so um, 
yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about like this kind of stuff. Um, when, when this stuff happens, like my necklaces or whatever, they get stuck to it, so it makes a little ball thingy. So anybody know how to get rid of those? Please let me know. Um, so yeah, this is the bomber jacket. Three hundred dollars. Very cute. Very cozy, baby. It's cozy pink, a a aka pussy pink. Um, so yeah, do we have any more envelopes? So I think it's just those ones. Usually we have like Ivy Parker right here or something, but like we don't. So this one was very easy, very simple, and yeah. Okay, I'm running through this fast. Yay me, that's right. Okay, so we have this little cat suit, uh, short cat suit, I'll say that. Um, this is very cute. Now we do have the three stripes right here. I forgot how much she costs also. <laughs> um, but we do have the saving from the bomber jacket with that little thing on the back of the zipper and has ID park on it and zip all the way down. And this time, uh, unlike the camo one that we got in the uh, Ivy, Par not Paradise, Ivy um, Park Trail, Park Trail, um, that one was like a regular black zipper. This one's very thick and it's like the color pink right here. So those are very, very thick. Now, um, this does stretch a lot. So there is some, some stretch to it. So y'all will be good. Um, this is also a size large. Like I said, I get all my women's stuff in a size large. Um, but it's very cute, very comfortable. If you guys sweat a lot, the sweat will show through this, of course. Um, yeah, we have three stripes right here. Um, I don't think that we have anywhere else that says Ivy Park besides this piece right here. Um, in the tag, of course, but I don't think... Oh, I lied, I lied, I found it, y'all. Uh, we have right on the sleeve, it says Ivy Park. I have no idea if y'all can see that or not, but it says Ivy Park right there. And does it say Ivy Park on the other side, or did they just leave them out? I don't know, here is the little Adidas flower with the Adidas glow. Yeah, right there, a little Adidas, period. So, yeah, that is this item right here for you. It's very cute, very cute, very cute. This is also one of my options to wear to the Renaissance World Tour. Um, this one or the camel one, and I have special uh, editions that go with it. So, I might just wear that. And next, we have the stoned, how much, I think this is 150, but this is the stone tank top. Now, everyone was like, I don't wanna buy this, blah, 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 this and that, it's not gonna be cute. Bitch, this shit is cute as fuck. So um, definitely, um, if you can find this on any third-party website like Poshmark, Macari, Depop, The Rail Rail, anything like that, def I would definitely go and get this as soon as you can. Um, make sure they're charging either retail price or a little bit under retail or a little bit over retail. Don't, don't, definitely do not pay too much. But we have different stones in this one. We have, I think, I believe it's like um, red and silver and I think it's just red and silver and I think maybe some pink stones. I'm not quite for sure. But we do have the three stripes going all the way down on one side, I think. I can't really see the light. Oh my god, okay, there we go. We have like the three stripes going all the way down right here. I don't know if y'all can see that or not. But I'll definitely put it on for you guys. Um, for the and stuff. But then we have this in the back and it has the Adidas and it says Ivy Park on the bottom. It has the big Adidas flower and it's Ivy Park. Like what? Like who was doing this? Who was doing this? Because this is sickening. Like whoever came up with this collection, I know Beyonce did and I know that and stuff like that, but like girl, you did this. You really did this. You really did this. Like, oh my God, like you did this. But I believe this is 150. I got this in a size small. It is very oversized, honey. Very oversized. I could have did an extra small, maybe a 2X small. No, probably an extra small. But um, I love it. It has been worn a lot. I wore it at Pride. Um, Pride in the park for us. So, and I wear this performing a lot. But this, quality, honey, quality. I believe I've only had one stone fall off. And I performed in it multiple times. So definitely go get you one if you can. Um, for uh, logos and stuff that we have, I believe, does it have anything? I think it's just this big logo right here. That's it. So yeah. On to the next one, we have 
the sarong. Now you can wear it as like a hair piece thing that goes way down. You can wear it around your waist. I believe this was $75. Maybe it could be more, I don't know. Um, it's cute. It has the same thing as the, um, as the, uh, oh my God, I forgot what it's called. It has the same thing as the uh, tank, there we go, tank. And that's the only big logo that we got. We got big logos, so I love that. Uh, but this is very cute to like, on your little swim, or you want to be, just want to be fancy one day, just have tie your hair up or whatever, and tie your hair into this, and just be like, mm -hmm. you can wear it as a shawl. Like, there's so much stuff you can do with this. And I got it in a uh, small medium, small medium, right? Yeah, small medium, small medium. Very cute, very cute, very cute. Uh, I'm trying to think. Would I return this? No. I mean, I can't now because everything is gone but I definitely I haven't even wore it and I took the tags off to wear it one for a show and I just never wore it but it's okay it's whatever but on to the next item we're almost done you guys we're almost done this is a little quick one we almost done okay so we have this sequin not sequin oh my gosh the rhinestone crop top now this was 150 and the pants part of this was 200 and I said, we're just gonna get one because the other one is, um, no, we're not doing that. I spent $1,900, well, a little bit, I guess, under $1,900 now because the fact that they never sent me my button up. But it's okay, it's okay. Um, but yes, this, I wear this a lot for shows also. I wore this at Pride at the Bar and y'all ate this up, honey. Y'all ate it up. Okay, but so. I got this in a size, what size did I get this? I think in a medium. I got in a size medium. And now we have the three stripes going all the way down right here. Um, and that's very cute. I think it's on both sides. We have the three stripes going on both sides. And we actually have an Ivy Park piece right here. Don't mind it being a little crusty looking, don't mind. But um, we have the little Ivy Park right here. Um, and then we have the Adidas on the other side, so yeah. This one's very cute. It doesn't have the big, big, big um, Ivy Park on it, but we at least we have envelopes, of course. And on to the next because we gonna run through this real fast. Now we have the bodysuit and the shrug. The bodysuit is reversible, and as you can see, it is pink on the other side. It's reversible, but this is what the a little piece of what they wore on tour with the uh, the sequin um, pants. You know what I'm trying to talk about. <laughs> um, but we have the bodysuit. The bodysuit is very, very, very stretchy. Now it is meant for water. Um, and it definitely is um, tight on me as a man. Um, but it gets the job done. I have to wear the correct underwear with these, but yeah, these are very cute. The shrug does have the hood. And you guys, the ladies or fellas or anybody in between, uh, you guys can put your hair through this little piece right here of the hood. Now for, we have the, uh, before we do the logos, we have the three straps going all, all the way down on each side of the shrug, of course. The shrug is not reversible, if you guys were asking me about that. Um, I believe, I got this in a size large. I definitely could have did an extra large, maybe, maybe, but I'm fine with the large. Uh, for logos, we do have the Ivy Park logo right here on this side, and we do have the Adidas logo on that side also. Um, I don't know how much this was priced at, so it will be in the corner for you guys to see. Um, yeah, here, let me, let me take this off and let me reverse it for y'all. But here's the shrug just by itself. It's very cute just by itself. But um, let me reverse it for you. Oh, honey, I'm hungry. I'm gonna have some wings up after this. Okay, so it's very plain. It's very plain right here, uh, but when you turn it around, you have your little logos back there. So, yeah, it's a cute little, you know, bodysuit or whatever. And y'all can wear this if y'all don't want to swim in it. Y'all can wear it to the stove. Y'all can wear it out to the club. Y'all can wear it to the Renaissance World Tour. Uh, but yeah, this is cute. But. There's that for you. And on to the looks item, because honey, um, I think this is my, oh, it's my last item. Okay, so we have, oh, excuse me, I had to burp for a second, but it didn't come out all the way. Okay, so we have, did I say, did I got this one? I said, did I got this one. I don't remember how this was this one. 
but we have the button up um we have the regular button up now it's not it's like it's the same button up that we got in flex park like before uh, just different colorway basically we have the monogram the mo brown monogram three stripes three stripes and um what does it have the logos okay so we have the Diaz logo right there and we have Penny Park logo on that side. So yeah, this is Ivy Paradise. Now I do wish that they would have released the socks, the regular socks, not just the heel socks. And I do wish they would release the other bags and stuff that we had. But um and the stuff that from Brazil. Like what how do you like not release everything Adidas? Like get that together. Please get it together for the next and final drop. I believe there is one more left. Uh, I think after the tour, she's gonna re I think she's gonna release something. That's that's what I think. I hope she do. But um, anyways, this drop was. I'll give it a eight out of ten, and it would have got a nine if we would have got everything. I think, but this drop was very cute. Um, it was more than what we expected, but the dates, they tried to trick us online because on Instagram, they definitely told us um, it wasn't gonna drop till July something, I believe, or whenever the, it said that date, but then we got a date that was earlier that the press release released, or the people, the Adidas press release had, you know, went through. And I was like, oh my God, it's coming. Like this Friday, it's coming. And also the fact that no other retails got, retailers got it. It was only on adidas.com here in America. What is up with that? Cause like overseas, there was other places I was trying to get stuff and they had it other places other than Adidas. Anyways, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Please subscribe, like, comment on this video. I'm finally getting it out and y'all have an amazing rest of your day. Peace out. I love y'all. Yay!